So how did you first become interested in researching bone and osteoporosis? Well, to go way back, that was actually related to my own chronic um, leg pain as a runner. Uh, and so my original research was based in medial tibial stress syndrome or, or what people used to call shin splints and tibial stress fracture. So moving on um, probably about 10 years or so after, after dabbling in that, um, it became very obvious to me that really the major burden for bone conditions is osteoporosis. And whereas stress fractures, bone stress injuries will heal themselves if you just leave them alone, uh, osteoporosis is not something that's going to heal itself. And, uh, and, it, and because bone is amenable to change when you load it, then it was really a great candidate for an exercise intervention. And as an exercise physiologist, it seemed like a, like a, a problem that we could tackle 